Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. Uh, today's topic is uh, nail fungus, or uh, also known as uh, anicomycosis or the tinea angua. But before starting this topic, I would like to request you to subscribe this channel for more informative videos every day. Now, the many keys in the fingernails or the toenails may cause uh, people to think uh, they have the fungal nail infection, you know. And uh, medically known as, uh, as I said earlier, uh, anicomycosis or the tinea angua. So these are the medical names for the fungal nail infection. Now, the fungal infection of the nail sometimes makes uh, the condition sound uh, contagious are related to the poor hygiene but in fact uh, up to 10 percent of all the adults in the western countries have the fungal infections of the nails you know and uh, this percentage uh, increases to 20 percent of adults where uh, who are age 60 or older you know now the toenail fungus is uh, much more common than uh, the fingernails, you know, and uh, you know, in reality, the abnormal looking nails may be caused by a number of uh, conditions, including uh, but not limited to the uh, fungal infection. And uh, uh, there are many other reasons why your nails look like different, you know, uh, from the other nails, you know. So uh, all the abnormal nails are not the fungal infections, you know. So you should consult the dermatologist if you have any kind of the problem. And uh, once diagnosed with the fungal nail, there are um, uh, topical medications, antifungal medications which are available. And uh, sometimes they are very effective, you know, like nail polishes, especially, especially um, for the uh, kind of uh, uh, fungal nails, you know. and uh, uh, if the topical medications, if they don't work, then uh, anti-fungal medications uh, are given orally, but they have a few side effects as well. They can have a neg negative impact on the liver, you know, so uh, you need to be careful, you know, and uh, uh, if your doctor prescribes you the anti-fungal medications, then uh, he will monitor the uh, liver function test. Uh, so it should be closely monitored, you know. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you need more information about any disease in your medical condition, you can visit our website www.diseasesandtreatment.com. And please do not forget to subscribe to this channel for more informative videos every day. Thank you and goodbye.